<laughs> Hello. So me, Elizabeth and Maria are in Doolin today. We're staying in, okay, actually you won't be able to see. We're staying, we're glamping. Okay, it's a little, there's a glamping tent. We, we came last night. <laughs> Like check out the room so like when you come in the tent we've got a chair we've got we've got all this room we've got a lovely fire going double bed single bed another chair it's just really really nice delighted with this like we're now on our way to go for breakfast and then we're going to do the cliffs and more boat tour which has been on my list for a long time i feel like i've seen it from like south to north south to north i've seen it from north to south and now I'm going to see it by boat. Can you get a helicopter to work? Yeah, probably. Yeah. That's the only way left now. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to have fun exploring around Claire. So see ya. See you there. We're parked up here going for our cruise of the Cliffs of Moher. There they are right there. You really don't have perspective, but in with eyeballs it looks very impressive from here i can actually see the the tower of the visitor center as well and then we're going to find a savage beach and we're all getting in the ocean i'm not on my face and I'm only 23 and that's just speaking for me this tour was 25 euro per person and I booked it online beforehand. It would have been so good, but I was stupid and did not take motion sickness tablets, so I was sick the entire time. So definitely take some, because the water was choppy. When you got to the Cliffs of Moher, there was a voiceover which told you the history of the cliffs, a bit about the sea life. The girls enjoyed seeing the puffins and everything, while I was just sick at the bottom of the boat. So learn from my mistake. That looks like right now. <laughs> After being car sick yesterday, we're like not fair and too good on the boat today. But your luck has to be done. just let our tummies settle before we got back in the car we just hung around the pier and took some instagram pictures had a little wander around the beach and we just had a bit of fun really which is exactly what you should do on a girls trip right so <laughs> i have wanted to do this boat tour for years because like i've been to cliffs more so many times like on foot but i've always wanted to see it from the water so booked this tour last night it was like buzzing this morning got on this boat it was so like choppy so we had to like sit inside and then we finally got to the cliffs and more part where you can like enjoy it I had to go downstairs and try and subtly throw up over the side of the boat the entire time and it was really embarrassing but I actually like opened the floodgates for everybody because once I got sick multiple people came over like there's this girl that couldn't even speak English and she was like me get sick next me get sick next and then she got sick and then someone else came over so really I helped a lot of people because clearly other people were too embarrassed and then once I did it they all did it or they all vomited because they seen you throw up <laughs> I could have caused it yeah you also puked your medication into the sea yeah I'm on antibiotics and ruined my oh my god is that bad for the ocean <laughs> but anyway <laughs> so big Fail. Missed it all because I was getting sick. That actually so made me feel I saw it more sick. Yeah, yeah I was trying to listen. So I saw it, I liked fail. it. So after the boat trip we just took a little wander around Doolan village which is actually really small. This is like the popular street with Cus O'Connor's pub. We went for an amazing lunch and then the girls spent a really long time taking pictures. It was actually really funny because there was cars trying to reverse into spots and they were literally blocking the way. There was people walking by laughing, feeling very sorry for me standing there watching. But anyway, they found somewhere else to get their shots. Then we took a wander around some of the woolen mills. We wanted to get some iron jumpers and we got some here in the popular iron jumper shop in Doolan Village. Then we all piled back in the car to look at some amazing Claire scenery. Making all the same mistakes that I made when I was 16. Never thought of making money, feeling more like a pipe dream. Life on track, yeah. I swear this basement's gonna be the death of me. So I cry with the 
we could not go to Doolin without visiting the Cliffs of Moher. We did go to the visitor centre and we paid to park in the car park, but it can be quite expensive if there's multiple people. So just so you're aware, you can walk for free directly from Doolin. It does take an hour or two, but it's along the cliff, so you have amazing views the whole way there. Or if you walk into the visitor centre without parking, you also don't have to pay. So we definitely took full advantage of being there. We had a good walk around and the weather was amazing. And then unfortunately our Doolin trip had come to an end so we packed in the car and we went home. But anyway, take a look at some of my shots that we took on the trip and please follow me on Instagram if you haven't already and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Go to college with a loan that you're never gonna pay off That's proper. Hey, oh, I look disgusting. Hold on a minute. Yes, so do I. You've actually introduced yourself in my video. My name is Elizabeth. Oh, God, I look fat. Wait. My name is Elizabeth. <laughs> at Elizabeth Keenan X on Instagram or everythingobsessed.com. She said, What's your blog name? Jesus. We need to know a little Hey, Maria. <laughs>